I want to improve my blowjob skills. Like, yeah. is there any like tips you can give me with how to give a better blowjob? Yeah, yeah. Do you think that you're good at giving head? I think uh, I'm not. Your lip, are your lips your real lips? Is my real lips? Those are your real lips. Yeah. Lucky you. Yeah, I got those real lips. But the problem is, yeah. like, I think guys just love when I suck their dick. They'll lie to me about how good I am. Yeah. So I feel like I got, you know, like you tell a dog, good job. You know, dog's like, eh. You know, yeah. so they think they can motivate me into doing more. But I yeah. know deep in my heart, you might come in as the yeah. um, critique right. that I don't think I was good. I think I was just giving participation trophy right i'm right, not right, right. good so you think they're just saying like oh you're this is so good but they're like lying yeah i think they're just lying I, so yeah get more bjs but more i want B- to I be wonder. really good at it so yeah. i can control them hi guys i'm jelly summers welcome back to tiger milf podcast today i have a very very special guest she is beautiful she is iconic and she's her own woman and she didn't give a fuck. She's funny as hell. And uh, we have a special connection because uh, I met her during our early days, our open making days. And I'm ready for the very beautiful, very funny Gabby Lim. That was such a sweet intro. You might be the only one who thinks I'm beautiful. Who oh, you definitely it? are beautiful. That's so sweet. But you, you and I are both crazy. Yeah. I don't remember. Wait, I don't remember when we met. Was it at the comedy store? I think like when we just like... Uh, Try to get on the uh, uh, improv uh, uh, audition mics. Really? Okay. Trying to get on the I have such a bad memory. Audition okay. mics. I I I don't remember things because I drink a lot when I was younger. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. But I remember you. Yeah, you yeah, are yeah. unforgettable. Yeah, I remember you too. I just don't remember when we met, and I don't know how long ago we, it was. We 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 um we are kind of like a two creatures that is not popular in the mainstream but yeah. we are also very special and beautiful and we always had a good energy together well, it's so cause funny because you are doing really well like you are i see you everywhere i think i just there wasn't if i had the chance to be liked or favored by a big comedian who brought me on the road let me open for them mm-hmm. it would be so much easier for me but it never happened to me yeah so i had to be like a self-made yeah i had to blow up on my social media buy my own comedy club yeah and like a just like a get into the clubs and get into the clubs to give me a show and uh, show them I can sell tickets. They're like, oh, you actually yeah. can do it because I'm just like a, a weirdo who don't speak English, who yeah. has a mean, love you long time accent. Right, yeah. And uh, people just don't believe in me. They're like, oh, wow, we've never seen an a- Asian woman with an accent to sell out this before. Like, yeah, yeah, yeah. I can't bank on you. Like, yeah. Until I show them what I can do, they go, oh. Yeah. So I just feel like it's very hard uh, for for both of us, we, because we are very different, like we are different in different ways, but like we are very mm-hmm. like we are very different from other people. Mm-hmm. Like they can't put us in a category. That's yeah. what I say. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's true. It's mm-hmm. waste. But you're you're touring right now and like headlining, right? Mm-hmm. Yeah. I, I, I'm doing theaters weekends. I, I'm doing well. You've been doing theaters. Yeah. God, good for you. I, I I love the money. I yeah. love the fans. Mm-hmm. I love uh, everything. I just uh, really. Just, I had to do it on my own. I have to build my own audience it's really and hard sell to do my that. own tickets. Yeah, it's really because there's no that. other way. Nobody's gonna believe in me unless they're like, "Oh, you sell out." Okay. Uh, yeah. We want you because we like money, and people come back. You know. Yeah. Like when people come back to watch you, they know you've been doing theaters on your own. Mm-hmm. It's so great. Yeah, I, I, I just, I kind of, I thank God for social media. Yeah. I skipped the uh, featuring. Yeah. Part, but I worked every night. I had my own com. I mean, I still have my own club. Yeah. I, I'm, I, I'm a workaholic. Thank God, I, yeah. I don't have to talk to my children. I just mm-hmm. go to yeah, work. Yeah, good, and you shouldn't. I'm like, I bring home money. You don't mm-hmm. have a dad. Like, yeah. be nice to me. Yeah, I'm yeah, the only thing you got. You're all that they've got. Yeah, yeah. 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 And if they act out, throw them away. Lock them exactly. Up. I yeah. mean, I'll keep my son, my daughter. <laughs> yeah. You can take her. I'll take her. Yeah, she's cute. So you can, yeah. okay, you I can like train that. her to... How old is she? She's three. She's like still trainable. She, yeah, she can make shoes and, you know... She can make shoes? She can be child labor. Okay, yeah. She and can, I don't have to pay her that well. No, you don't. And you are a painter. You have your art right you can train yeah. her to put little sprinkles little accents on your, and stuff on yeah, yeah yeah on yeah, your yeah, canvas. yeah i like that yeah little tiny fingers she can mm-hmm. do my hair yeah she had little fingers yeah setting little stones and yeah 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 good. oh my god i can teach you, her to do yeah, my nails because, i don't know yeah. how to oh do, yeah, yeah she can put she can put little diamonds yeah on yeah yeah, yeah she have a steady fingers. hand mm-hmm. oh yeah very steady because <laughs> i spank her if she's not okay so you've raised her right yeah she's she's beautiful yeah she's really great yeah I'm happy you are here, Gabby. Thank you for having me. We've always been very friendly towards each other. Mm-hmm. We always liked you. i always very impressed with your talents. We never That's really so get uh, to sit down and have a, 
a one-on-one -on -one girls that girl mm -hmm. time. Mm -hmm. It's hard to do that anyway. You know, it's like everybody's schedules are all fucking over the place. Mm -hmm. It's hard to like see people make plans. It's just, I get to know people like through doing shit like this, like through seeing them like out doing stand up or podcast. Yeah, because we actually spend time together, getting to know each other. Yeah, that's just wonderful. Yeah, I I, I saw that uh, you can make regular jeans cool gabby jeans i was painting them for a long time i i really stopped doing art mm -hmm. i was just like burnt out from it it's a lot of work it is Painting's because you're a perfectionist yeah and it's a, yeah and i was just like this is hard you should charge more uh, yeah. i should be your art agent too. i know well the only I mean, problem is that you should charge more 250 for like a pair of jeans right if you ping them they should it's hard it's hard to like bargain that and so then i was like charging people like you know 75 a hundred dollars for a pair of jeans and then like that's a lot of money for people and i was like this is but it's too much work like it is a lot of work it's to give, way like, too much fucking like, work. i know who you are like yeah. you are gonna give all your heart and soul make sure it's like uh, yeah gonna be good enough to be worn by kim kardashian yeah and so you're yeah. gonna spend your time on it uh, you're just uh, you're just a true artist you don't compromise yeah that's a good thing well that's why i had to stop though i was like yeah. this is too much you're burning out i can yeah. see it i can mm -hmm. see it so mm -hmm. what do you like uh what what do you do other than stand up uh, with your art and everything? That's it. Yeah, you I've just, just been doing my. I've just been doing stand up. I mm -hmm. haven't been doing any art. Okay. Yeah. But you have so many talents though. Thank you so much. Um, I I one of one of like you you are so funny, and I one of your uh, video you talk about but don't have his tits. You have to give good BJ's. Uh, like, yeah, yeah, yeah. That that uh that that joke. Yeah, you have to suck. I have to suck dick because I don't have any tits. When you don't have tits, you have to suck dick. Those are the rules. Uh huh. Because those are the rules. Like, is there like I want to improve my blowjob skills? Like, yeah. is there any like tips you can give me with how to give a better blowjob? Yeah, yeah. Do you think that you're good at giving head? I think uh, I'm not. Your lip, are your lips your real lips? Is my real lips? Those are your real lips. Yeah. Lucky you. Yeah, I got those real lips, but the problem is yeah. like I think guys just love when I suck their dick. They will lie to me about how good I am. Yeah. So I feel like I got you know like you tell a dog good job, and the dog's like eh, you know. Yeah. So they think they can motivate me into doing more, but I yeah. know deep in my heart, in my communist uh, yeah. um, critique, right. that I don't think I was good. I think I was just giving participation trophy right i'm right, not right, right. good so you think they're just saying like oh you're this is so good but they're like lying yeah i think they're just lying I, so yeah get more bjs but more i want B to I be wonder. really good at it so yeah. i can control them me too i try i want to get really com i want to be like a competitive dick sucker i yeah, want to like, be really when good you are it. so good at it you can actually mentally manipulate them yes you can be like um my rex is broken um, yeah i want the one with the diamonds right Ah, that's a, yeah, I like that. Ah. That's that's what you have. So, to what do. is the, like the, the special tip you would share with a sister? You know, it's so funny. What I can share with a sister. Um, when I was younger, I was hooking up with this guy, and he would like direct me on how to suck dick. So, <sighs> <laughs> I learned from the best, you know. And then I took that and I applied it to like every other guy that I would suck off, and they mm -hmm. were all like, "This is the best head I've ever gotten." I said, "Thank you. I was trained, mm -hmm. trained." So what was like the special tip you can share? What is the specialty? You know, um, it. I feel like all guys are different, right? But you know, some like a little extra time on the head, some mm -hmm. the, the more tongue. I use a I use a lot of tongue. So like I when you grab it, it's like like use your tongue go around it a little bit. You gotta mm -hmm. switch it up a little bit. Yeah, you got direction, different directions. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because I I have to be really cognizant too of my teeth. I'm like, am I being too toothy? Mm -hmm. You know, I don't know. It's just. I don't know. It's like it's like tongue and grip, you know. You want to. I try to. Mm -hmm. I try to really emulate what it would feel like to have a pussy in my mouth. Yeah, I talked to a a, a friend that he told me that uh, he's very disappointed mm -hmm. on women. They 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 hold dick. They 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 they're like milking it. You shouldn't be milking. You should be like putting it down. Okay. Like going downwards is how can how you make them come. And milking going is down. Not gonna, okay. Don't do this. Do like. Going down. Going down. I think. Interesting. I, I don't know why. It, I I believe that, but yeah, like, uh, he's a biologist, so I think. So yeah, he's so a he's right. He's a scientist. Yeah, he told yeah. me that. Uh, he's right. He was giving education to me and my Japanese friend. Yeah. Oh, my Japanese friend. I had a Japanese friend. She used to be a porn star. Yeah. So she told me is really that, uh, the key to get yeah. good BJ is like uh, is actually in the men's mind. It's not on in the dick. You just mm -hmm. have to be super, super, super submissive. Pretend like you think what they say matters. And you, you have to be submissive. 
Like I'm not submissive, but like what, what, when they tell me, like do this, and you just did. It's like, oh, I never know. Oh, that's so good. Yeah. You're right. You're right. Yeah, yeah, you yeah. You tell them how right they are. They come in here. Yeah. Then they come in here. Right. It's more about like mind fucking them. Right. Like guys are simple. Yes. Like they come when they hear like they are just like that. A, they're right. They're so right. They yeah. know everything. They know everything about dick. That's true. Yeah, like a you know dick lord. Right. So you don't even have to suck dick. All you have to do is say you're right. You're right. You're right. Yeah. You're like, oh my god, I can't believe it. I didn't know I should do that. I'm oh. Right. Oh yes. Yeah. Oh. Right. Do I put my tongue this way? Oh my god. I never heard that before. Thank you so much. Right. They want to be my life. That's it. They yeah. want to tell you. They want to be the one to teach you. And then you're like, oh my god, this I, is. I, oh my god. You know. Yeah. So she's like, a, uh, they are full of shit, but I just do that. So yeah. they come. And they listen to me. I do the same thing. Yeah. Then she's like, in real life, they listen to me. Why yeah. listen to me in bed? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm like, that's very Japanese of you. She, I mean, her self esteem is high. I have very oh, she, low self esteem. She has very high self esteem. Yeah, good for her. You have low self esteem. Me very too. Very low self esteem. Me too. Yeah, yeah. Tell yeah. me about the thing you did uh, that's caused by low self esteem. I can share one with you because you know I share my shit with you. So okay, so things you're saying things that I've done mm-hmm. out of having low self esteem. Yes, like in relationships. Um, honestly, like not speaking up when I don't like something, Mm -hmm. you know, um, I, I'm not, I'm not good at being like, Hey, I didn't like that. I didn't like the way that you talked to me right then. Mm -hmm. I'm very like, Oh, I'm sorry. I don't know. Or like, I don't say, I don't say if something hurts my feelings necessarily, or I'll just like, there's a, okay. So with the dick sucking, the dick sucking thing too, I think there's two, it's a double edged sword. So I suck dick because I like to suck dick. But mm-hmm. on the other hand, I also do it because I'm like, but I just want them to like me so much. So I'm going to suck their dick so they like me a lot, you know? Mm-hmm. So I think when you're sucking dick with that energy, mm-hmm. they feel that and they're like. They try to, they know they can control you. Yes. Yes. Because yeah, I think I'm controlling them, but then they're. Yeah. Because the at the energy. end of the day, I'm the one who's. It's like, like being on stage when they don't laugh and we try to please them. We start telling things. They know we are trying to pleasing them. They yes. don't laugh more because yes. they're like, oh, you want me to like you. I won't like you. Huh? It's like yeah. a whole fucking mind fucking game. It is a fucking, it is a mind game. It oh is. my God. It and is. I, I do that thing too. A lot of the time I'm really working on this, but like after I have sex, I'll be like, was that good? Did, was that okay? And it's like, oh, like. Mm-hmm. In my soul, I'm not that bitch, but like I get so turned around with men that like I just like want to please. So I'm like, is that okay for you? Are you is that I'm good? Yeah, but Gabby, but when you tell them me, uh, tell this to me, I just I, I relate to this so much because uh, as a little girl, our whole fucking life, we are educated, brainwashed yeah. to say yes to everything. Yeah. When we say no, we are being difficult. Yeah. We are not elegant. We are uh-huh. annoying. Yeah. And we are not likable. And we are attention seeking. Yeah. Cunt. Yeah. So and I think that, and I feel like that, you know, what we've done with our careers, uh, like the way that we are is like in rebellion of being like, of being cognizant of that. Right. So mm-hmm. it's like you grow up knowing that like you're, you have to be like the submissive, like, you know, like, feminine thing and then you grow up and you're like i don't want to be that i'm going to rebel against that and i'm going to do comedy i'm going to look the way that i want to look i'm going to blah 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 because it's like a way to have Mm -hmm. to like have autonomy yeah i i I identify as a very very strong woman yeah and then there's some details some moment happens to me i just got neck i just got knocked down into this little girl who's insecure who yeah. don't, who's not sure of who I am and right. I would uh, make a decision like I want, I'm love but like a no when I would uh, say yes to something because I feel bad for them I don't want them to not like me and then right. then I realize I have all the power right. like uh, fuck off like, yeah. uh, why would I say yes to this bullshit yeah. then I realize one thing is like uh, we all mind can 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 like deceive us, but it's our so body, true. Yeah. but our body, the biology of it, when we feel something in our gut is just like icky yeah we feel it we should follow it yeah like we should just like it when we feel like when we see a dick we're like no i want to suck it but i want you like me yeah but i should just be like no I'm yeah you have to it. listen to that like the gut the yeah. gut because yeah, the, the biological the left we can we can trust right yeah because our heads do they, the they play the little the little girl us. game yeah yeah little girl game comes out i want to be like i want yeah yeah even like a very powerful woman they mm-hmm. would uh, sometimes be like why would you do that like mm-hmm. when you see like a amazing powerful woman would mm-hmm. be around like a shitty shitty disgusting man you're yeah. like you don't need this like that's, that's why like uh, i know it's annoying when i say that but like i like sheer she's like a man yeah i don't we yeah. don't need a man in our life like uh, uh her yeah. mom's like a married rich guy she's like i'm the rich man yeah i am me yeah like, i'm the rich guy yeah and she did like younger men people like you why don't you date your man your age she's like they all die yeah that's so funny <laughs> well they do yeah yeah They're, yeah it's 
I don't know. And like the women that I've always looked uh, looked up to too are like the, like are more mannish women in a way, in a sense, you know, where they're like yeah. more power. Joan Rivers, Chelsea Handler. I don't mm-hmm. fuck, like all of those. The kind of like brazen, mm-hmm. like out there women. Those are always what I thought. I was like, oh, that's powerful. They seem yeah. They seem like powerful and in control. And I people like just that. like same with Madonna, you know. Yeah. I just love her so much. I yeah. just like I feel like uh, people are like whenever I even have a bikini photos they're like oh she's not funny that's why she's selling her body I'm like uh, everybody people say that of course I do yeah there's an ugly yeah. cunts with the bikini photo yeah. every like Lizzo has her crotch out yeah in bra- like Lizzo has her fucking crotch out every day yeah and you think it's beautiful the moment yeah. I wear a bikini I'm a whore yeah why like, you why should i not of, like my body i know and i get a lot of like when people don't like me they always it's a lot of men being like oh are you on OnlyFans? Oh, okay this is like only you should they like insult me with that and be, or they're like yeah where is your only fans at and i'm like, like i don't know i i have only fans and i make a lot of money without doing any sexual content i was thinking about getting I'm, one because you of should that. You should. And you're not doing like nude Nothing, stuff? Nothing. No. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. Anything you see on Instagram mm-hmm. is like I have a bikini photo and on my OnlyFans I would have the whole set in that same bikini photo. Yeah. And that's how we sell but all like like daily greetings but like I'm having breakfast. Hi guys, what's up? Yeah. This and this. Like I have selfie and videos. That's yeah. what I do. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And also I have the early release of my podcast on there. Okay. Yeah, you should do it. Yeah. You should find. I want do to, it. and I, I yeah, not to do. I mean, Whitney Cummings has it, and Does my she? ref has it. Yeah, yeah. Oh, I didn't know that Whitney. Cardi had. B has it. Cardi has an OnlyFans. She makes twenty million dollars a year. I'm sure. She and does. she has uh, no nudity. Yeah, it's all behind the scenes stuff. Yeah, the thing is like uh, take advantage of being sexy and funny. That's right, though. Because no mm-hmm. people, people take money away from you to tell you you're ugly, you're stupid, you're they, not funny. Yeah, so right. they can control you and people who are jealous of you, they can stop you from uh, being who you are. Mm-hmm. Y- you know, you mm-hmm. you you are like, the, all the thing you do is sexy and funny. Yeah. Like, same, him, same here. I'm not yeah. going to apologize for it because are you going to pay my mortgage? Yeah, right. Are you? Are you going to pay for my comedy you're not, special you're taping? Not, yeah. Are you going to buy me a different outfit every night for my comedy shows? Because yeah. I like new sl- clothes. Yeah. I like jewelry, new clothes. I like bling bling. Like I like my son go to um, private school because he's a Chinese boy. He needs yeah. to go to private school. He's got to go to private school. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Yeah, I think you should. Yeah, I know. I should. I should. I should. I think you should do like the funny stuff. Yeah. Yeah, I wouldn't do nudity. I wouldn't do any of that. Not that there's anything against it. I just like, I, I'm too, that's too, like, too vulnerable for me. I think I you should just like, uh, uh, do, do funny stuff. Yeah. Uh, like, uh, do just like, uh, just do greetings yeah. about the thing you do right now on Instagram. Talk yeah. about mental health. Talk yeah. about like all the stuff. Because it, it is scary being that open about like shit on social media because people are horrible and mm-hmm. like it, people have so much access to you all the time so they can just say like the meanest shit and there's nothing mm-hmm. you can do. Yeah, people say mean shit to me. Like, oh my God, I can't so imagine. It's so awful. Yeah. They're like, oh, you got fat. That's why, you know, you're taking off your clothes. Your yeah. husband left. That's why. You, I'm like, I'm not taking off And friends. as soon, I'm sure as soon as you got single, people like took the man's side and they're mm-hmm. like, look, this is why he left you. Da, 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 da. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. I see that all the time with my friends who are like, who are comedians who are going through breakups and it's always like, they're always taking the man's side and they're like, yeah, you nasty whore. That's mm-hmm. why. He mm-hmm. he dodged a bullet. I'm like these guys are horrible. They would do anything to fuck you. They do. They would do anything to fuck you. But they're yeah. so mad. Yeah. yeah. I I just feel like uh, um I would have never yelled to a man ever again. Yeah. When I say men, I mean people who want to fuck with me. Yeah. Because it's it's been it's just been hard, Gabby. Like at the moment. If you think about it, we reflect our childhood. I was born during the one child policy in China. So crazy. When I was born, my I I was born. My mother and my father made sure to have me in our own home. So when I was born, I'm not on the record of live birth. So when really I don't because because you're a girl. Yeah, because it was not legal to get uh, an ultrasound. You they just to to prevent people from getting abortions early when they see the girl. Really? So they won't allow ultrasound back then. So they do not know. But they were prepared that if I was a girl, they would uh, get, get rid of me. Like I was told. Wow. And it's not just like I was told. I had my mother's friend uh-huh. who was pregnant at the same time and who had a baby girl and they, yeah. they don't exist. They're gone. They like don't exist in the government? Yeah. And also, like they physically don't exist. They were given away. They, were, they put them up for adoption? just sold to some people who can't even have kids no way seems like that or get rid of like literally like gone because so that's that's what was happening back then is like there's not the one child policy anymore right no okay so back then it was 
really only like to keep boys mm -hmm. and a lot of girls were given up for mm -hmm. adoption or, or like get off like just like thrown away as like abandoned baby are you serious i'm serious and uh, i was told that, that so is uh, my crazy. fate my, my my mom would tell me all the time oh just casually God. we would be having chicken feet you know it's collagen it's good for you mm. good for your yeah. pussy too and then she'd be like oh by the way eat more chicken feet because like, you're ugly you have to make sure you have tight pussy yeah yeah yeah. you gotta and have I'm a like, tight pussy yeah yeah i'm like there's a chicken feet give I'm you like, a tight pussy <laughs> like, mom it's tuesday like what yes. do i have to tell like, well, i'm like, five yeah i do yeah i'm five i'm five yeah. i'm making naked shoes fast enough like yeah, yeah, doing good yeah, in yeah. the factory and it just uh, I I I like I don't even think it's trauma yeah. that I was told I wasn't wanted, I wasn't needed as a girl. Right. I just felt like I need to have to work harder, jump harder, yeah. jump higher, write faster, memorize things more. Right. So I can be useful because yeah. I felt like I'm a burden. I'm it's like, so crazy. I was a burden. My mother, for yeah. keeping me, she gave so much, and she got a huge fine. Like she, it no her way. job, her house. That's why people just like, you, they don't want a second child. If they had a daughter, they know that's their fate. They'll never have a son because that's it. That was it. But she was like, no, 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 no. I want more kids. You can take my house. My pussy to keep giving. No way. Yeah, she's like, I'm having babies. Yeah. Like, I'm until I got a son. So she is bossy like me. She's how like, many no, kids, take my house. How many siblings do you have? She had one more daughter. Finally, she got a, a son. She has, okay, so. She kept my sister too. She was not bright, you know? Really? So my mom really, my mom was the kind of person she doesn't uh, believe in the fate. She goes, well, I'll take the house. Yeah. Yeah, I'm gonna make buy a new house. I'm gonna work. Yeah. So she worked very hard, uh, and she was able to finally get her son, herself a son. So you have a sister and then a younger, a younger brother. brother. Wait, so wait, 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 wait. He just I... robbed, my brother just called me crying, like, I need a new iPhone. He's like a three years younger than me. Where I does have he to live? Buy my new iPhone in China. He's in China? Yeah. Is your I... sister in China too? Yes. Okay. Wait, so this is so crazy. So did she have you in a hospital? No. No. Um, oh, at home. Because you couldn't be... She wanted to keep you like off the record. Yeah. So if I was a girl, she can get rid of me and have a new baby that she never had a baby before. She did that with your sister too. Uh, yeah. But the thing is, like, uh, I just found out my birthday. Yeah. Is wrong. No way. So it was. I was twenty three, and uh, I said, "Mom, I was looking at the Chinese lunar calendar. My birthday is December eight, December uh, twenty six, and uh, in that year, nineteen eighty nine. My American calendar birth should be uh, January 21st, but on my ID is January 18th. She goes, wow. I know. So your real birthday is the 21st? Yeah. So I've been celebrating the January 18th for 23 years. No way. I said, do you know that? She goes, of course I do. I said, wow. why would you do that? Uh -huh. She goes, well, I was writing down your birthday and I realized that 18 means going to be rich and 21 is just the basic. So I want to make sure you got some extra luck from the numbers of your birthday no way so um you're welcome well yeah you are welcome I said, but i've been missing my birthday forever she goes who cares yeah. i said i do yeah. she goes you shouldn't yeah wow she that said, you shouldn't wild yeah like i shouldn't i don't even have time to process it yeah that's just like a uh, normal you know and uh uh Wow. Wait, when did you leave China? I left when I was 18 years old. Okay. I came to University of Kentucky for college. Ew, weird. <laughs> How was that? Lexington, Kentucky. Really? <laughs> was... From China to Kentucky? I mean, uh, yeah. That was uh, that was crazy. It was Why crazy. did you go there? I just need to, like, I want to go to America to become an actress. <laughs> and you said Kentucky is the place. You said, there we go. <laughs> there we go. I Kentucky. want to go to my Twitter park. I just uh, did not ha had any help with getting my visa, so yeah. I went to, to uh, study TOEFL exam, TOEFL exam, and uh, I got my first offer from yeah. that school. I got other offers later on, but I was just going to leave. Yeah. I needed this uh, little offer to get a visa to come okay. to America. I just so I can drive to LA or New York. Oh, my God. How about you? Like, uh, why are you so fucked up? Because I'm telling you about me. Like, why am I so When you are a little girl, like, you yeah. memory. I didn't, we didn't have the one child policy, so mm -hmm. that's, I got out safe with that one. Nice. Yeah. Um, I am my mom's only kid, though. Nice. One and done. But she, when my mom, my mom told me that when she got pregnant with me, she was like, I will never have a son. I will not allow my body to harbor a man mm -hmm. inside of it. So I better only, like, I'm having a girl, no men, no men inside of me. And so then, she's meditating when yeah. she got pregnant with you. She's meditating. Maybe you're, she said, no, man, no, maybe man. you're a baby boy, but then you're like, let me cut my dick off before my mom yeah, well, kills me. She had a couple abortions before me. So mm -hmm. I'm like, you know, maybe she was just clearing the path. But she mm -hmm. said, no, 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 no men here. And no men like me. Yeah. 
So she no country for old men. Yeah, no country for old men. But my dad has two sons mm -hmm. from a previous marriage, mm -hmm. so he got you know I have two older half brothers. But are yeah. you guys close? A little bit, mm -hmm. not really. Mm -hmm. Um, but we've been—I don't know. Like we're becoming like closer in adulthood. But yeah, no, I'm. I feel like I'm fucked up because well, my mom. Okay, so you know how it is like a trickle down of fucking trauma mm -hmm. in mm -hmm. families. My mom's dad, my grandpa, he was from Egypt and he was like a super fucking crazy Arab guy who just was like, you know, so sexist. Mm -hmm. Didn't he had a bunch of girls. Mm -hmm. He had three girls and then the youngest was my uncle and all he ever wanted was a son. Mm -hmm. And he was like an angry Arab guy and he fucking, you know, like misogynist, a sexist guy. And I think that really fucked my mom up. Mm -hmm. And so that made her like a hard woman, mm -hmm. you know? And then she was like a hard woman to me. Mm -hmm. And she wanted me to be like a very certain type of person, which was like very educated. Mm -hmm. She wanted me to like be, you know, like, like proper educated. Um, I don't know, like that kind of a person. And I just, I think I just rebelled like from a very young age. So you just, the Margaret showed her. Yeah. Yeah. Like, Margaret, I'm gonna Margaret show you on this one. Mommy. Yeah, I did. I said I'm not gonna do I'll never I'm never gonna be what you want me to be. And I think it was like from a very young age. I was does like, she yeah. hate your tattoos? Hate some. Fucking hate some. What did you want to do when did she see your tattoo? Once I started getting a lot of them, she just was like, There's nothing I can do anymore. But like the first one she saw, she lost her fucking mind, screamed at me, and then I was like well, I want to get another one. And she took that really, <laughs> she took that really personal. And she was like, you know, you're really disrespecting me when you do that. And I was like, well, fuck off, bitch. Fuck it's off. Not, it's not about you. get a tattoo. It's on my body. Yeah. No, she couldn't stand it. Does your mom hate yours? Oh, she hates it. She, hates. I remember when I got my first tattoo. Yeah. Uh, I didn't tell her. She said, that, oh, by the way, if you are getting one of those little tattoos, I have some like a really nice sushi knife. Mm -hmm. Sushi knife. And I can use the knife to just like uh, cut, it cut off. the skin off. Yeah to remove it from you yeah and then when she saw it uh, it was like little actually empress wu thing it's uh -huh. like uh, the chinese emperor she's uh -huh. the only woman who ruled china in five thousand years oh, yeah, so cool. and uh, when it was two thousand years ago when she was the emperor and the beauty about it is like she was a woman she has male concubines yeah i love that and uh, she her. made it before her uh, the Confucius is actually is great but a uh, part of it is very sexist yeah it basically control women from getting education yeah. So she basically destroyed all the rules and uh, she provides a woman and yeah. men have the same opportunity to getting educated and become government officials. And men hated her. They yeah. wanted to destroy her. They destroyed all. Like, she burned. was the only woman who ruled China? Yeah, she wasn't uh, like a, a queen ruled with the king. Yeah. She was emperor. She How did that happen? Male concubines. It was just a phenomenon story. Her father was a very powerful general and uh, when she was a little girl and her brother getting educated she has to learn how to um wow. i don't know like how to do all like fixing clothing and stuff she's like fuck that shit yeah i want to learn to fencing uh -huh. i want to learn um confucius and Taoism. i want to yeah. learn all of the things about government i want to learn everything yeah i want to learn math i want to learn everything yeah so she just uh, literally she was so smart and uh, sweet her father just loved her so much yeah. he just kind of like uh, let her get education with her brother under the table because it's not legal that's so fucking crazy and, uh, because yeah. she just like uh, the, her father's little apple in the eye like yeah. uh, he loved her so much uh, he's like uh, closing one eye open one eye and yeah she's just like uh, smarter than all of them yeah so smart yeah, of course she was yeah she was also so beautiful mm -hmm. so when she was 13 years old uh, i think uh, people were talking about uh, like the very beautiful high government officials kid who should be coming to uh, the uh, palace to be the next uh, group of uh, concubines okay. some of them don't really get to see the king okay they just they basically are like a, a thousand of them that the king would uh, take a one like a card it's like i'm gonna fuck this one tonight okay yeah and most of them don't see the king until yeah. the end of their life yeah and so um she was told he, she would never see him and uh, she was like uh, Oh, she was very upset, but uh, she just wanted to read more. So she just kept reading and stuff. Mm -hmm. And then one day the king called her and she went there. She was 13 years old. Mm -hmm. He said, I don't trust the people around me, people who write for me, 
would uh, basically manipulate the, my, lang my, my language and wording for my speech uh, for their own benefits. You don't have any agenda. You are 13 years old, but yeah. I heard you are super educated. Uh -huh. You memorize all of the Taoism and Confucianism and all of, the, all of it. She goes, yes, I do. Yeah. He goes, would you become my secretary? She goes, yes. And uh, she literally wrote debates, read new policies Look at that. since when she's, she's 13 for 10 years. And uh, he never let her, uh, he was like 55 when she was uh -huh. 13. Mm -hmm. And uh, he was dying. He said, I, I know I can sum summon you to be my wife because you are my concubine, but uh, I have too much respect for you because you are brilliant. Wow. You are a politician. You are a real politician. Yeah. You are a writer. You are a philosopher. <gasps> and uh, I'm not going to lay my hand on you my old dying hand and I want you to know that finally uh, finally a been, man who respects a woman yeah you that. being a politician uh -huh. and I would have wanted to protect you from getting um, expelled because you are my still considered my wife so after I die all of you thousands of you are going to be expelled in a nunnery mm -hmm. cause, because you you are like the king's woman you cannot remarry mm -hmm. you cannot serve any other man so mm -hmm. you all go to nunnery like uh, become a nun So she was sent to, uh, he, he promised her it won't happen to her, but uh, like uh, people are jealous of her after he died, uh, she was sent to a nunnery. Okay. She was packing her stuff. The young prince yeah. is going to become the king. Yeah. It's her age. They um, knows that she has been the secretary to, to his father and how valuable she is, how amazing she is. Yeah. He had a crush on her. Uh -huh. He's like, I am in love with you. And uh, I'm very impressed with your talent, and I wanted you all the time, but I know I can't because that's incest. Because incest, because right. you are my father's woman. She said that he never touched me. He okay. respected me so much, okay. and I would prefer to be going to the nunnery. I'm a Buddhist woman. Like wow. I don't need to be marrying a man, enjoying the lust or sex. I don't care about it. I can wow. go to my nunnery and yeah. keep my studying with my philosophy. So she said, I'm going to the nunnery. And also, I don't think we should get married because it's not going to happen. And when she went to the nunnery, she realized how much she loved um, being a politician because she made the king to cut the budget with military expenses, uh -huh. spending more money for uh, agriculture investment mm -hmm. and having women to get education and also stop corruption. Yeah. She wanted to stop the... Uh, people getting becoming becoming like uh, have access to power through their family because their family is powerful so they have easier access mm -hmm. she wants to give opportunity to people who are peasants through education okay so she wants to make it more fair she's like in Confucius study is that the okay. people uh, when we have power we can't abuse them uh, we have to give them love and support wow and have them thrive yeah. together yeah that would in enable you for a longer rule of yeah. the country you can rule the country longer, there's less war when everybody's happier. That's so no, woman. That's such a woman Even move. today, yeah. even today. Even to, yeah. Yeah. She, 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 she built the Silk Road and yeah. she made it legal for women to study. And uh, um, wow. six months later, he came to the nunnery. He, he said, people are uh, basically um, overpowering me. It was like the military uh, guys are literally trying to threaten me to give them power. They want to add budget for the military and they are powerful. I can't say no. I'm mm -hmm. just like, I don't know what to do. What can you do? She goes, uh, I will help you to get your power back and make China better because we are going to give more power to the people. Yeah. Because the more power individuals have, they are going to overthrow you. If the right. more power you go to the people, the people support you. They can't uh, right. take you down. And then he said, I'm taking you back as uh, um, my concubine. Mm -hmm. And uh, the thing is that is the whole China is against it. Especially the, uh, the government officials because they know how smart, powerful she is. Mm -hmm. They are afraid the moment that he has her mm -hmm. by his side, they can't overthrow him. Mm -hmm. So uh, so he took her in a horse carriage in front of the palace. There's like uh, the armed generals, like uh, Empress Wu, like uh, Wu Zetian is not going to be entering this this gate. We are going to ruin all China's morals because she was your father's wife. And if you marry her, right. that's incest. You are going to be disrespected by the whole China and uh, we can't rule like this. Yeah. And uh, he goes, I have okay. to marry royal, her. The royal people love incest, though. I can't believe they stopped yeah. it there. She has to come in, and he said, over my dead body. And so Empress Wu, she walked out from her horse carriage. Mm -hmm. She used a knife, and she slit his throat.
Wow. He said, now you have your dead body. Can I go over it? Wow. She walked over his dead body. Wow. I mean, and, and, she and then wrote, she got in. Yeah. She got in. Yeah. And uh, um, the, the, um, the, the empresses, like uh, the queen of uh, the king was very jealous and mm-hmm. very scared of her. Yeah. And so he... Uh, she was pregnant and he poisoned her. She got an abortion when really? the baby's eight month old. Is that, did she die? She was alive. Empress Wu was yeah. alive, but uh, she lost her baby, first yeah. baby, which is a boy. Yeah. Uh-uh. She lost the baby and she almost died. She lost her voice for a long time. She recovered yeah. after six months. Did she ever end up having more kids? She had a second baby uh-huh. and is a princess. Uh-huh. So she invites the, uh, the, the queen to come in to see her baby. Yeah. And then she said, I'll bring you some tea. The queen walked out to bring some dessert for her. She choked her own baby girl. And then she walked back. She's like, oh my God, my baby died. So she called the king. She's like, I think the queen murdered my baby, murdered our princess. There's nobody. But she did it. She did it. Nobody on earth would believe she would choke her own baby. Yeah, we, why? I'm so, okay. Because she knows that... Uh, um, the queen is gonna kill her and the baby later anyway. Really? Yeah, she will. That was what the yeah, because she poisoned the first baby. Right. The only reason why she's if she had a new baby. That's horrible. She killed her own baby. Uh huh. And then nobody would have believed she would choke her own baby. Yeah, right. There's no way people would believe that. So the king was convinced that it was the queen. Yeah. So that she's in the queen. He's in the queen to prison. And uh, then she talked to Munich. She's like, I want her dad in prison because if she's still alive, her brother is yeah. the general. Yeah. He is going to come back and kill me. I want her dad. Okay. And then after that, she started writing policies for him yeah. and uh, helping him. But then he got really sick. Mm-hmm. He, he had a stroke. So she basically started ruling China. Yeah. And uh, uh, when she had her son and he was a moron, so she helped him, but she was able to just like, She had a third China. one. Yeah. Okay. She had like a lot of uh, concubines, a okay. sexy young man to yeah, eat yeah. her pussy. Yeah, Anyways, yeah. I should shut the fuck up, but this, she's my role model. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So that's, that's so her cool. name. Okay. That's Was- Zhao. Zhao. It means uh, the sun and the moon and the sky. It means my power is above the sun and the moon and the sky. Okay, I she love that. that. I, she said they made me do it because deep in my heart, I know if I was emperor, China is better off with me as emperor right. because a woman can study and instead of spending all the money for military defense, we actually spend the money for the people. Men love to spend money yeah. on military. For education. Yeah. Uh, which is what we need, which is the m- number one thing. Like, education is the most important fucking yeah. thing. It's what needs to be funded the most. Yeah. She said, if it's, I have to kill you guys to do what's right, I'll yeah. do it because I'm just better. Yeah. So she ruled China for mm-hmm. 50 years. China was the most pros- prosperous. It was a Tang dynasty. Really? China is the Look richest, the most... Pro- like, the, the silk... Look at uh, that. All of, uh, yeah, everything was just the best. Yeah. And women yes. were actually just like, uh, uh, the beauty standard is being fat. Oh, really? She just like let that. women eat. I like that. Women just like eating food. Yeah. They're, they're well, because that's like the beauty standard. That was like the beauty standard for men back then. Remember, like the kings, all of the fucking kings, mm-hmm. like King Henry, all of those motherfuckers, the European kings, they were like mm-hmm. the fattest motherfuckers. Mm-hmm. And they all yeah, loved, because they have freedom. Then they love to have big calves anyway. that like show that they were wealthy. Yeah. Yeah, I should shut up. But I just got so excited about her. But no, I love that. She's my role model. Whenever I say, is this okay? I'm like, I think about what the Wu would do. Yeah. She would, she would do would everything. Fuck off. Yeah. She would have beheaded every man. Mm-hmm. Yeah. That was amazing. After she's like, uh, over your dead body. Yeah. She walked down. She goes. It's kind of. She didn't even see it. He yeah. didn't even see it coming. Because he's a general. He's like very powerful. Yeah. Everybody's like on their knees. Yeah. She's like, oh. Ahead uh, of her time. Who, who, who is next? She goes, who's next? Yeah. No, people are all on their knees. Yeah. Like, no. I Not love me. that. Cause you just never see she that goes, woman. you made me do it. I didn't want to kill you, but yeah. I'm coming in. Yeah. That's so He goes, you're not coming in over my dad. Was body. China communist? Has China always been communist? It will be, it was communist later on with the Russian influence, like uh, the okay. Marx philosophy. Okay. After like, uh, uh, after Russia, uh-huh. like, uh, um, what do you call it? The USSR. What do you think? Okay. This, is, this might sound really fucking stupid, but I need to know. Cause I don't know shit about politics. I don't know shit about anything actually. Do you think, coming from a communist country, do you think that it works? China is the Chinese characteristic uh, communism. It means that uh, they make it uh, that is suitable for China. Okay. Because like the pure communism doesn't work because Russia failed. Right. Because I believe that uh, uh, lazy people should be poor. Yeah. Ugly people should know they're ugly. Ugly people should also be poor. Yeah. They should be poor and they should know that they're ugly. Yeah. Yeah. So I feel so. like uh, like in China, it's very hardcore. Like we don't believe in uh, p- 
participation participation trophy. Okay. If you are not first place, if you are second place, you are the first loser. Like in、okay. Japan, if you fail, you know you kill yourself with a sword、okay. before you bring shame to the emperor. Right, right, right. right. So if you are second place, you should be the first amount to commit suicide. Oh, I would have had to kill、shame. myself so long ago. I know. So like the Chinese.、Uh, Like Chinese,、uh, I think like the Chinese way of the、uh, um, it's just it's not it's 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 like very Chinese characteristic、uh, combined with a lot of like、uh, Confucianism, Taoism,、yeah. like that.、Uh, we just、uh, like you can't just、uh, everybody share the same thing. It, yeah, it's not happen. We are animals. We are beasts. Yeah, we are. We are animals. I believe in Darwin. Like、yeah. uh, the strong survive, the weak die. Yeah, that's how it is. Yeah, you have to mentally and、uh, physically to be strong to survive、yeah. because life is tough. Yeah. The parents can tell how beautiful, how smart the children is, but like they have to grow up one day and get go to study and realize they're ugly and stupid and、yeah. lazy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like I don't have room for laziness. Like when I see somebody who has who was born an American citizen,、yeah. who's not mentally disabled, and who is begging me for money, I'll be、mm. like, you should starve. Okay, so you hate the homeless. But mentally ill people, I think they should get a better health care. Yeah, 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 yeah. But like if you are like literally.、Mm-hmm. You are healthy. Yeah, you are not mentally disabled. Yeah, you are just lazy and playing victim. And, just, a, and that's so much of America.、It. That's so much of America. We just America. can't handle it. Yeah, and we don't take care of our homeless. We don't. We, we don't, don't take care of the mentally ill people. We don't take care of the mentally ill people. And there are so many. I mean, it is a crazy country to be born into. Like, to be here because there are so many just fucking strict, just lazy, entitled people because they're American. They're yeah, like, I I deserve this because I'm American. It's like you didn't do shit for this. Yeah, you're just like a fucking just, fat just, loser. Exactly. And like, I don't even mean fat like a derogatory way. I mean, just it's like not derogatory. There's the sexy fat people. Yeah, there are beautiful fat, fat people. people. But so the, many. But the, yeah, yeah. People get so angry when you. I yeah. Mean, I, I'm sorry, Gabby, but I'm gonna show you this. Yeah. I can't. I I was seeing this. I want to vomit.、Mm-hmm. I was so angry at this, and I was so angry at people being okay with this bullshit. It's also interesting. We're like. So we're, this this, Dustin, can you put this on on here? I'm gonna airdrop you this, Dustin. Like I cannot stand it. Like that drive me crazy. It's not okay. It's literally like not okay, so I just airdrop you this. That's it. Okay, I I'm just、uh, I'm I I'm not being mean. I'm just being. I was just being fair about this. Is that you? No. Yeah. Oh my、this. god, you look so cute. <laughs> okay, so um, Lizzo she posted this and she said, "If I'm not your best dress, that you're fat phobic." Uh huh. What do you think of that? I just feel like、uh, it's she's gone too far. You think so? With uh, being a victim, uh-huh. threatening like morally kidnapping people、uh-huh. to tell her she's the most、yeah. best dressed person. Yeah. If she they don't say that,、uh-huh. they are fat phobic.、Mm-hmm. It's like me putting chocolate in my hair. It's like if I'm not the best dressed, you are. You you are racist against Chinese people, right? Yeah. No, I look like a monkey. Like I have chopstick in my hair. Like it's not good. Yeah. Fashion is fashion. Like、uh, yeah. I I I wish Joan Rivers is still alive. Yeah, yeah, yeah. To tell her. Yeah. She is wearing a diva cup. Yeah. She is wearing a diva cup. Yeah. Like yeah. Can I see it? But、yeah. don't you think like this is? I don't get. I mean, she's a beautiful girl. This is she what's happening. She has great skin. Yeah. She can sing. Yeah. She's a star. Like、yeah. let's just be honest. She is, she's、yeah. a fucking star. Yeah. Like a, just like like why? Like this is a big.、Uh, yeah. Is the capital V? Yeah. I don't get it. I mean, I okay. I will say, like in her defense, I feel like she is being. She's like you know, obviously trying to be funny. Uh huh. But she's、um, not. But it is also layered because it does co- it does play into that like whole victim complex thing, which is like it's huge right now. You know, like、mm-hmm. everything. Like her. Everything is、yeah, like her. Everything is like everything is offensive. Yeah, everything, everything's offensive. Everything's offensive. You have to be, you have to be really.、Uh, you have to be like an activist now. You know, you have to.、Mm-hmm. Be, it's crazy. I I don't participate in any of it because it's like I don't, I don't know. I don't agree. Yeah. Um. I'm also just not like I have nothing to say. I, but it's also not funny.、Say. She tries to be funny. She's not us, but she tries to be funny. Yeah, yeah. yeah. But she's just like a, trying to be funny. Yeah, it's like the the victim kind of funny.、It's、yeah, like it is. A, if you don't like me,、uh, you're stupid.、It's, you're stupid. It, but it's interesting because this. But that is like I feel like the the, the language that we're all speaking now、yeah. is like everybody's a victim.、Mm-hmm. It's this weird like victim complex of like overcompensating, and that's like what a lot of our like. I think America needs a Chinese mom. America could use a Chinese mom. Like, just be honest. Yeah, like when you are, like you know, Gabby, like in school, like your、mm-hmm. kid is slow. Yeah, teacher's like he's very special. Yeah, 
in China, like a, your sign is not special. Yeah, he which is, I do think is good. Which I do think we should implement more of in our culture. But it's difficult because it's then it becomes this thing because America's so sensitive to this. Why now, are we right? so sensitive, Gabby? Can you so please tell us? I don't know why they're so sensitive. Where it's, are you from? Gabby. San Diego. San Diego. So you're like an all American girl. Yeah, all American girl. Like, why are you Americans so sensitive? So sensitive. I We're don't the know. same age, right? Am I older than you? I'm 32. Oh my God. I'm your mom. I'm 34. Yeah, you are my mom. I'm 34. Yeah, you're my mom. Yeah. That's so much. Oh, you're so, so old. So why are you Americans so sensitive? I don't know. But I think it's gotten worse. I think it's absolutely like right now is like the worst I think it's ever been with the sensitivity stuff. Um, I think that Americans are way more like lenient with their children, more forgiving. Like we want to make sure that everybody like feels okay and is taken mm -hmm. care of. And it's like, you know, your child's just as good as this other child, which in a way too, I understand. Mm -hmm. But I do think that there is absolutely something to like being like, no, you got to fucking work harder. Yeah. You got to be smarter. You got to, I mean, that's, that's why also why like, China I, I, I have two kids. Yeah. Um, I have a boy and a girl. My son's five, my daughter is three. I, I know they are different. My son is sweet. He's a little weak. My daughter is, weak? is also sweet and smart. They're both smart. But yeah. my daughter is a savage. Yeah. She is going to divide and conquer. Yeah. I'm going to tell my son, I'm like, look, Winston, she's she's just, she's more savage than you. And she's going to get more than you in yeah. life. Yeah, 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 you yeah. better do other things better. Yeah. You, you be polite. You work hard. Because... Mm -hmm. Your sister is cunning. Like she's gonna make it yeah. without uh, me worry about it. But I worry yeah. about you. Don't have the same standard as her. She's gonna get her shit done. Yeah. She is. Yeah. She she she's a snake. Mm -hmm. Okay. Well, she knows. She knows. Snake. She knows deep down that she has to work harder to get what she wants. Oh yeah, she knows it. She and knows she uh, I just heard harder. a story. My yeah. mom called me. Goes that uh, your daughter is three years old. Mm -hmm. We have uh, five crying baby here. Mm -hmm. All of your cousins' kids. Her all her um, cousins. They are mm -hmm. five, six, five. And five. Mm -hmm. And uh, she beat up all of them. Mm -hmm. She got all their toys. Mm -hmm. And she didn't even talk about it. Yeah. She just sitting there playing and it. smiling. Yeah. And we asked her what happened. She goes, oh, they crying. I didn't know. Yeah. Like, we don't even know when she she's beat them. She's a sociopath. Them. And they, yeah. Yeah. She'll get what so she wants. She's going to get what she wants. And yeah. Winston, you have to work hard. I won't be like, your, your sister is the same as you. I will tell him, yeah. honey, you have to be charming. Like, you have to smile yeah. when you say hi to people. Yeah, Look yeah, at them yeah. in the eyes. Yeah. Don't do this. You know, just you, you need to make that effort in order to get what she gets. Yeah. Cause she's going to be a billionaire. She's going to have 20 boyfriends mm -hmm. and she's going to she have is. yachts. And you are going to in your Honda fit yeah. and just tell, ask me fit. why I didn't educate you earlier. Right. I don't want to be the mom who's so, not fair. Was he, he's, he was born in America, right? Yeah. He's so he's American. Is, yeah. So he's going to then grow up probably too with that like kind of like lazy American mm -hmm. mindset as, you know. Yeah. No so I want him to, to. Yeah. But like, I think that is, um, I feel like it is kind of a. It is easier, I think, as an American man too, to be a little bit more like lax and mm -hmm. lazy because there is yeah. like an entitlement. There's like an they are American so entitled. They think of the yeah. whole world. Like, but he might have a leg up because he's Chinese. But like he has to work hard because he's not gonna get the same opportunity as other American guys. You don't think so? The Chinese guys, I mean, they just like model minority. They don't get the same opportunities. They have to be making extra money in order to, Wait, in order to get the same girl. I just thought about something, and we're gonna have to take a real quick subject change because I just thought about this. What now? I have a huge question about porn. I love porn. <laughs> Let's talk about porn, Gabby. So, okay, because I will watch. I will watch Chinese porn sometimes. Why is it always blurred out? On is it is a Japanese porn? Ja is that Japanese porn? They don't mm -hmm. do that in China. Uh, we don't have porn. Porn's not legal. Porn's not legal in China. In China. Okay, so yeah. the Japanese. Porn. Okay, yeah. it's Japanese porn. Yeah, yeah. Why do they do that? I don't know why. I feel like they think his because the Japanese culture is so they they blur weird. out they blur out like the men's penises. Yeah, they are they show so the, women's tits. the Japanese culture is so conservative. At the same time, they are so sex forward. Do you they see have how, an orgy in yeah. high school for all the kids to explore sex and fuck everybody? Like yeah, it's, it happens. But then they think it's offensive to show yeah. the dick. I right. think the Japanese porn is the secret to the Toyota success. It's interesting. They just don't want you to see it. Well, and they also and it all seems kind of rapey. Have you ever noticed it's that? It's very rapey. Why it's is it like the, the, like the women are like girl. crying? Yeah, and the women they, are like crying and they're like ita, afraid. Ita, it means yeah. it hurts. Really? <laughs> when they come and they say, Ita! It hurts really? so much! It hurts so much! They cry about how much it hurts. Why is come. that? So, do, so then do they Japanese enjoy women think... Torture they enjoy women. Are they, but are they conditioned to think that, that that's like what's attractive? I think a Japanese men are so like, uh, they, they just like, they've been so contained in a fucking And like repressed, box. yeah. So repressed because yeah. like, after they lost the World War II, because Japan is a very 
like fasty countries, they invade. Yeah, they just like they take over, and they they just after World War Two, they are not allowed to have their armies. Like yeah. there's a size, yeah, yeah, they yeah. can't have it. Okay. And the and the I mean, America is after like a Pearl Harbor bombing. Yeah. After they they got bombed with the atom bombs. Like America yeah. is having a closer look with their military. And they just like they are so surprised, mm-hmm. Japanese men. Yeah. So I feel like in porn, they just like express the, them being They're like, just, ah, yeah. I'm gonna, or, I'm gonna overpower, I'm gonna rape you, I'm gonna fucking yeah. rip that, murder that pussy. And uh, yeah, that's that's but what I get. Girls are so beautiful. They always choose the most ugly men. They're the ugly too. men, beautiful women, beautiful like scared women. Scared, like they yeah. like, the more they cry. Yeah, they cry, and the men are like they beg to on stop. It. It. There's like, no porn yamate, in China. Yamate, like when they fuck, like yamate. Means please stop. I'm no, begging you to stop. That's so crazy. When they come, he died. It hurts so much. That is come. so crazy. And okay, so and porn is like totally illegal in China, mm-hmm. but it has to be. It's still like made, isn't it? Uh, it's like we watch Japanese porn under the table. Really? I worked in my um really? my cousin's little video shop. We would have the Hollywood movies. We would have Hong Kong movies, and in a little drawer, we have little Japanese porns. Can you access? Porn websites in China, or is it all blocked you, by firewall? If you uh, go, you cross the wall. Yeah. How do you really? You you just uh, have some device to uh, go through the firewall. So you can't just like get on your porn. phone and go on Pornhub no, in China. You can't. No fucking way. Yeah. It's crazy because that's how it is in certain states now too. Like you can't get into Pornhub in like certain states in the South or in the Midwest. I mean, what's the point? I yeah, I know it's crazy. They have yeah. a block on them. I think where was I recently? Like St. Louis can't get porn there so they fuck their porn sisters hub. you can't do it in- you can't watch people fucking their sisters on you can't porn, watch so you, people, you have watch to yours. use a different website but you can't mm-hmm. use Pornhub. you can't watch yeah that's crazy no sister fucking. the dog loves you hi honey yeah you can't watch that's gabby's dog shit. yeah that's my dog that's the look at this you have to take a photo this is that's my gabby's dog. dog that's my dog he's that, gonna take a photo of you. that is wild okay i mean so porn awful. is i got i you fantasize get- about uh, like taking 10 dicks do you really i won't do it but yeah, like uh, i just uh, worship uh, like people like angela white who can take 10 dicks no thanks i just i think you she's an athlete that. i i don't want it to me but i when i watch it yeah. i i'm I, i'm on my knees i have respect like i just like wow. i'm like that's that's a porn star yeah she's yeah, a she fucking a star, star. A star. Uh, she takes dicks she's artistic she just yeah. like she knows what to do she, she know what to do with them. it's hard to know what to do with what she's, she's one yeah she's she, yeah exactly she's not overwhelmed yeah like i just see this as a star but like when i see yeah, a girl is, just yeah. like one on one porn i'm like i can do this like yeah. why are you trying to show me this the thing yeah. you i can actually do at home also they have no tricks they're like ah ah they come i'm like yeah you like tricks? I can do it. Like, yeah. oh, I can, I just I want I like people do things I can't do. Right. Like, I worship right, people right. who do it's better than me at doing things. I get that. Right. Yeah. I mean, no insult for the girls who just release like a basic one on one porn. Yeah. But, POV uh, kind of. POV. Yeah, yeah. Just like I don't know. Yeah. I would never like I'm a true romantic. You are. Because yeah. I'm so stupid. Yeah. I'm so traditional. Like I would never do a threesome. You would never do a threesome. I just don't think I would enjoy it. Really? Because so I you like to watch. I porn. love gambam porn. I love uh, like so a triple penetration. It. No, 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 no. You don't watch that. No, I can't. It's too. I can only graphic. watch threesome porn if it's two women. I can't watch two men. It it, it overwhelms me. Yeah, because they are like uh, they uh, when it's two men they uh they do the slave thing. Like, I, they yeah, they her. do, and I just say, you know, there's no way that she's enjoying this, and maybe she is. I don't want to yuck anybody's yum, but I just go, that's just too many. It's mm-hmm. too many things going on at once. Mm-hmm. Too many penises. Yeah, dude. Like, are you are you just like get, uh, straight straight, or you like you could be bi? Mm, I'm pretty straight. I'm pretty straight. I don't think I could date a woman. I think I could like hook up with one, but I don't think I could date women. I like men. M- women are too crazy. Yeah, men are crazy too, but uh, they are. I think men are easier to manipulate. Yeah, women. I can't manipulate women. Like I can't do it. Well, and then for me, it, like comes down. I know, no, me either. I just can't do it like, to my sister. I can. I mean, I can barely manipulate a man. I, yeah, hardly. Yeah, you know, because so they are so hateful. I, I can do that, but for yeah. women, I'm like that's my. That can be my daughter. That right. can be my sister. Like, right. I can't do that to her. You can't do that to her. I I I, too, I have too much empathy for women. Yeah. Yeah, same here. Like I'm, I can't yeah. gaslight her. I'm like I can't do that to yeah, her. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because like, why would I, I use struggle. my own life to my own people? Yeah, yeah. Like I, I don't want to feel fat. Like I just like because I know how to, you know, what's it like to feel fat and ugly. Like I don't yeah. want you to feel the way that I resent. Right, and I don't want to. Treat I want your a body. man to feel like a loser. Right, right, right. And I don't want. I don't want to do to your body what they do to mine. So, exactly. You know? Yeah. So it's we're sacred. We're too sacred. Women are too sacred for me. I think yeah, that's yeah, like, yeah. You want to just put 
protect them. Yeah, I just want to protect you them. You want just the, either Having good sex pussy, with women seems evil. Yeah, either good pussy for a night and just uh, like a, call me angel over the morning and right. say goodbye. Yeah, that's right. Yeah, before it got ugly. Yeah. Become the daily. That's nice. You know what's her name? Uh, our friend is our mutual. She's our mutual friend. Audrey is stored. Yeah, love Audrey. So Audrey... Um, Yes, when I got when I met uh, Audrey, Audrey was a lesbian, and then yeah. uh, I think I had Audrey back the podcast like a year and a half ago. Yeah, Audrey told me that. Uh, oh, Jiaoying, by the way, I uh, I I I eat dick now. Like I am. Yeah, she eats man. dick now. Yeah. I am straight now. She sucks Wang, as she says. Wang, yeah, yeah. Like the, it's a Chinese. Really, the um, dick. the most lesbian way to say that you suck dick. Yeah, I'm just like, uh, and I realized how easy it was her for her to get a dick. I'm just like, uh, yeah. Are you dating? No, I. It's impossible for me to find a man because I'm yeah. just uh, too intimidating. Yeah, and I can't help. I'm only getting stronger and stronger by you day. You are only getting stronger. And like stronger. I'm just like I can feel. Yeah. Like I just feel like I'm just. Don't getting... you feel like though that like that's empowering? You get to a point where you're like, wait, I actually don't need to date because I'm so powerful. Yeah, I do. Like I just getting more and more powerful because think... I have okay. to. Okay. That being said, do you think that for women that dating is actually for weak women? I think it's for women who is brainwashed by society that they need a man. That they need a man, yeah. Like, I have those, like, in Chinese, we call it yeah. now. Like, yeah. a little, like, a relationship brain. Yeah. So, like, when they got in a relationship, they just, like, the man is the center of everything. Uh, yeah. It's just, it's like, true. That's thick how, sand. That's how it like, is thick for me, sand. too. Yeah. Like, thick sand. You're, like, you just, like, uh, uh. Yeah. I, I'm, like, I can't, I know I can't change anymore. Yeah. I'm just, it's, it's about me. It is. It's, uh, You've been through it. You had your those, kids. Now you're, like. two kids. Yeah. Like, they need to have the best life I never had. Yeah. And uh, I'm not going to compromise anything yeah. unless the man is right. Yeah. Yeah. That's true. I get that. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Because I lose myself big time. Same when I here. Date. Yeah. It's, it's just that uh, you can't help. me. Mm-hmm. You look so amazing. So, we have to hang out more. So, Dustin, yes. can you make sure she's on uh, the Ice House show in June? Oh okay. my God, I would love to. You have to do it. Yeah, it's going to be so fun. To. I love Ice House. My dog, you can take him home. Okay, I'll take yeah, him home. Yeah, it's a party favor. Yeah. Uh, I like that. Thank you for coming, Gabby. Where can oh my we God, find thank you? you? Um, Instagram, Gabby Lammy, TikTok, everything. Just Gabby Lammy. You'll find me there. Yes, yeah. amazing. Yeah, love you. Love you. Thank you so thank much. Thank you so much, sweetheart. Thank you. Thank I'm you. Gonna go home and watch some Japanese porn. Oh yeah, let's watch it together. Okay. Mm-hmm. Take your Red Bull. I will. <laughs>